So, this is my university, Beijing Film Academy. A new semester began. I feel how the time flies every day. New people coming into our university. Also, the spring already arrived. The weather is becoming warmer and better. It's really nice to go outside these days. But also, today I received an email telling me that next week I'm gonna have an interview from my admission process. I am really happy because I've been waiting for this for six months. So I'm really excited for this interview. I'm really happy. I'm gonna prepare this week so I can do my best so far. I'm studying Chinese, I'm making this blog a reality. I'm sharing my thoughts with others. I'm trying to film every week and to continue this project and this journey that I, that I wanna do. Last week, I had the opportunity to participate in my first shoot here in China. It was a homework for some students from the cinematography department, and it was a great opportunity for me to see how people shoot in, in China, how people film, and what kind of like process do they have, what kind of um, automatisms do they have, what kind of, how do they face a film, you know? This is something that for me was really important because if I'm planning to study here for the last three years of my life, and as I'm planning to, to, to be here, I, need to, I needed to know all of this. And for my good surprise, I saw things that I that really, really, I really like. I saw that the students who were uh, shooting this were really prepared and they were really uh, have a lot of talent and know a lot. And also I discovered that this university has a lot of toys for filmmaking. Yeah, I always been hearing and listening that this university have a lot of resources and a lot of, of structure for filmmaking, but I never knew until which extent. This is something I also uh, wanted to have, you know, during these three years. I saw lights, I saw cameras, I saw studios, I saw a lot of things that for our filmmaking are really important, even though I know that the most important things are not cameras and material stuff, but we like it or not, are, are part of the business. And having access to all of this for free if you're a student, it allows you to be able to make films, to, to you know, to, to do your own projects. And this is something that I wanted to do. This is why I came here, to be able to have access to all of this. So seeing it with my eyes and being able to confirm that I'm gonna be able to have access to all of this, for me was uh, a game changing. And this gave me motivation to, to, to study here. Uh, something that probably in the last six months I was debating to like if it's really worth it if it's something that is Actually, I need this like is it really gonna be like having I've been hearing um, and everybody has their own experience about living in China but so far for me uh, It's been really hard
I had to live a lot of things in my life. Um, I was living in Panama. I have a business there. I have, um, I have my family, my friends, uh, everything, my house. I left everything, even my dogs, you know? And uh, I really miss my dogs too. But um, I left my comfort zone and I wanted to know if I left everything over there for something that it was worth it. And so far I think it's up to me right now at this point. I have been realizing that it's up to me to give that importance or not. Why I came here for, it is something that I've been reflecting a lot. What do I want to get from this experience? Uh, what kind of people and what kind of person I'm going to become after all of this is what I've been reflecting the last couple of days and weeks. It's, something I, it's a project, it's a journey that I want to share with others, you know. And also this, this, this blog is an opportunity for me to continue practicing my abilities in filmmaking, which is something that for the last year I have been not been able to. I shot for the first time, like when I made my first block and I had my first experience shooting in an actual set last week. So this is an opportunity to also, you know, explore my my sensibility as a, as a filmmaker and to explore my, my, my passion and my cinematography and my style and to continue improving this, which is my main goal in, you know, all of this journey in Chinese, uh, there's this word called Tikal, which is, you know, uh, improve, improvement, you know. This is what I came here, to become a better filmmaker, a better human being, to become a better man, you know, um, to aspire to do these projects that I have in my mind. And if I'm able to study here, probably all of those things are going to be a reality. And if it doesn't, it's okay, we'll find another way to, you know, um, in this team we never give up and um, there's always a way to, but so far uh, the future looks bright, the future looks really appealing and I like challenges, you know, so please continue watching these videos, I'm gonna make another video next week to, to notify and to give updates about my exams. I hope I'm gonna have this result maybe next week or maybe in two weeks. I don't know, but I'm gonna continue posting uh, these videos and updating about this. So, uh, thank you for joining me in this journey. My name is Zayan Garcia, a filmmaker from Panama, and uh, I hope that you're okay, and please take care of yourself. Thank you for watching, bye bye.